All right, let's see if I can get this video to work nicely. So I have obviously a Planner Kate haul here. And I'm gonna take these guys out. Oh, there's a gun. Put those up for you. So we have the little samplers that you get. New little doodle girl sampler. Built these. And then I picked up let's see kit. Looks like it is 254. And then I got the U, S, and R. So the plain labels, deco, and then the sidebar. Mainly because I wanted the little bat for it. And that is with this guy here. So I use a plum paper for all of my memory keeping and for just daily use. So that goes with this kit. And I have an A5 right now in the plum paper. So I'm gonna try out the petite size to see if I can get it to work. I'm basically gonna cut off the like little label here but I know that a five sized month boxes fit the petite labels perfectly. So I'll, I'll try to do a little um, plan with me for September showing you the, those work. Uh, let's actually show you all the kits. I actually do use the mini kits. So this one's 253. I use the mini kits actually for my month view quite often just because it gives me the huge variety of labels and then this cover I use this to cover up the um, the sidebar little calendar at the bottom and then I actually use the washi across the top and then I just use the month scripts that she has over this to cover up that this is an old kit, um, 173J. This is the SMC5, A5 in the half letter. Just another kit to try and see if it would fit. And I would love, if, if it does fit, I would love Kate to bring these ones back. Hoping they fit. Uh, I use in 7.9 monthly tabbed for memory keeping. So I got this one here for the memory keeping for my little one. And I bought the uh, pocket size 164 as well for all basically to be able to use all of the deco labels. And then just some refills on ones I was missing. So S5, which is the dotted half labels. 358, the scalloped labels. 440, the dotted labels. These ones are new to me, the 478, these are the like the, oh I don't remember what these were called, but just some new labels for the memory keeping. And then 1066, which are the individual little checklists. I love these for my plum, because then I don't have to worry about trying to figure out which checklists actually fit her labels. So yeah, there you have it, a little, a little haul of all my fun little stickers. Thanks for watching.